Hello. Uh, my name is uh, Gedi Anikstal. I am one of the so-called international muffins, and I have been asked um, uh, from the younger women in the Magdalena project and their uh, uh, across the border project to answer some questions. Uh, there are uh, quite a lot of questions. <laughs> Uh, this is what we try to. Th this is what we use our whole life uh, to try to answer. And now I think I have something like two, three, four minutes. I'll go through it, and it will have to be a tabloid a version. But here we go. <coughs> Why? What is the most important thing for me in my work? Uh, that is uh, the autonomy. That is a sense of belonging, and a keenness, a need to learn. I think also it is important to be impatiently patient. What is my message for young uh, women starting their journey with theatre? I think, do you really want to do that? There are many, many other things to do than to make theatre. So if you really want to make theatre, you need to have this need, you need to want it. Otherwise, I would recommend a lot of other things you could spend your life doing. And the third question here is, what is the strongest and most powerful in working among persons who describe themselves as a woman? Solidarity, strength, again, the need to work together. Uh, I do think now, a days, that the description of what is a man, what is a woman, and everything in between, what is masculinity, what is uh, femininity, needs to have a kind of elasticity uh, around it. Let's go on. <clears throat> what kind of theatre am I creating? Um, we say in my group, in my theatre, that we create the theatre that we need and want to create uh, a bit independent from what would be the trend or the so-called uh, uh, fashion of the day, year, or month. Then another question is why I choose uh, to do theatre. I didn't. Not at all. I thought I was on my way to study medicine. Uh, I went to a workshop uh, around 40 years ago and I have not left. I think that I looked for a group, a place to survive, a place to belong, a place to be with people who had a goal, uh, uh, had some ideals and had a way of surviving, of not being mainstream, uh, of uh, defining themselves as a bit outside but still belonging. So I would say that the theatre uh, <laughs> chose me. Uh, so the next question is what theatre uh, means uh, to me? Since I've already told you that I've been doing this for the last 40 years, it is my life, uh, it is my work, it is what I do, it is also what other people define me uh, of being doing. Um, so the, the reflection or the echo or, or, or the warmth of what I'm doing should be, uh, uh, should be answered uh, by you. But I think we would say, some, summing it up, that it is a way, my way, of communicating. I hope that it's a human, inco encompassing way of living and surviving. And if I have not answered all the questions now, let us just meet and we can go on talking over a beer or a coffee. So long. Muffin, muffin.